Welcome back. The Supreme Court expected to give their ruling on Obamacare probably Monday. But if it strikes down the law in some port, uh, part, can we still get true health reform going forward? Our next guest says yes, and it's all about the free market. Dr. John C. Goodman is the author of a brand new book. It's called Priceless, Curing the Health Care Crisis. He joins us live from Dallas. Good morning, doctor. Glad to be with you. So it's your suggestion that if either all or part of Obamacare is thrown out. This is the perfect time to look at things that really work. And you, somebody who has been very uh, big behind health savings accounts, say that that's one of the things we could look into that would really make a big change and a big difference going forward. Oh, absolutely. Uh, patients should control more of their own health care dollars instead of giving all the money to these big and personal bureaucracies. And when the patients control the money, then over on the provider side, all of a sudden you see transparent prices. People compete for patients based on price and quality. All right, let's talk about health savings accounts. I know you were one of the inventors of that uh, suggestion. How's that going to help? Oh, because then patients control their own money. They make their own spending decisions. All of a sudden, you see uh, providers competing on price and quality. You see this in cosmetic surgery, LASIK surgery. There are walk-in clinics all over the country with posted prices. Wherever patients are spending their own money, healthcare markets work really well. And that's one of the reasons portable insurance is a good idea, too. You can take it anywhere, right? Yeah, you know, in most states, it's against the law for the employer to buy insurance for the employees that they own and can take with them from job to job. We need to turn those laws around. We would need to encourage portable insurance. We wouldn't have a problem with pre-existing conditions if people could take their insurance with them from job to job. And you mentioned pre-existing conditions, and that's one of your ideas to save money, insuring against pre-existing conditions. How would, how, how would that work? Well, you know, that's what we do with life insurance and with casualty insurance. If something goes wrong, uh, the insurance uh, pays for the, uh, for the repair. <laughs> and in health care, it would pay for the uh, medical expenses. And you don't get penalized because you have to move to another insurance company. Um, th there's a rational way to fix the insurance system without trying to force insurers to take people for a premium sure. that's way below the real cost of their care. Interesting stuff because Monday afternoon they may be looking for a plan B. They're all great ideas. Uh, you can read about them in the new book, Priceless. Dr. John Goodman, thank you very much for joining us today from the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex. Glad to be with you.